local election headquarters. Right now, Benton County voters are deciding on a potential countywide sales tax. Fox 24's Clarissa Bustamante is live in Bentonville with a look at today's special election. Clarissa? Chelsea, people who live in Benton County are voting for or against a new one a cent sales tax to fund a new course facility here in downtown Bentonville. Now, to break that down, that's about 12 cents per every $100 spent. The election administrator for Benton County says that so far they've seen 3,743 voters come out and cast their ballots. Now, that's about 5% voter turnout. We've talked to a couple of judges here in the county who says this courthouse is necessary to provide safety and security for the public, but it does come with a $35 million price tag. The county hopes to raise $25 million of that with this temporary tax lasting four and a half years. The other $10 million will be funded with existing county funds. Benton County Judge Barry Mooring says that this is the lowest incremental tax possible. No doubt it's a new tax, and, and people certainly are, are concerned about that. But this is a badly needed facility for all of Benton County. Mooring says the money from the tax will also provide for more parking downtown. If you haven't been able to get out and vote yet, don't worry, you still have time. Polling locations close at 7.30 tonight. We're live in Bentonville. Clarissa Bustamante, Fox 24 News. Clarissa, thank you. Now, according to Benton County's government website, at the current courthouse, the five judges are spread throughout three separate facilities in downtown Bentonville. Also, the Judicial Circuit Court has over 44,000 people per circuit judge, which is approximately twice the state average. James McCann, a poll worker, says it's been a slow day at the voting site. Personally, I think it's uh, very important uh, that they come out and vote. Number one, to vote. We have this freedom. We should take advantage of it. Uh, and uh, without voting, you know, be, why complain? If you didn't vote, don't complain. If approved, the new courts facility will be built between the 21C Hotel and the old post office in downtown Bentonville.